what is meant by bit masking bit masking means selecting only certain bits from bytes that might have many bits in to examine some bits of a bit byte the byte is bitwise added with the mask that is a number consisting of only those bits of interest for instance look at this flag and one um, at once digit that means rightmost digit of the variable flag you bitwise and it with a mask of one so the bitwise and operator in c is and to set the bits of interest the name is bitwise or with the bit masking the bitwise or operator in is or flags is equal to flags slash uh, or of one or equivalently flag or equal to one to clear the bits of interest the number is bitwise and it and with once complement of the bit mask the once complement is the number <coughs> with all its mm, bits changed to zero and all its zero bits changed to ones just like this or equivalently like this sometimes it is easier to macros to manipulate the flag values listing show shows a program that uses some macros to simplify the bit manipulation just we are going with the bit masking case used to switch a character between lower case and upper case and we'll get into the program straight away so hash defined bit underscore position n 1 u unsigned 1 left shift of n you pass n how many shifts which bit bit position you want you can check it set underscore flag n comma f n or equal to f this will set that particular bit bit flag and for clearing and equals to not equal to f you can try it you can put what does it mean you can use a one byte and um, left shift one that is one u is equal to zero x uh, zero 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 one i mean how many zeros if it is a long or normal or this thing left shift with n it will left shift to that particular position suppose we want it to the position number one uh, position number one uh, you left shift to one that way left shift by one then it will move towards that will become zero 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 one zero that means it will point to the first position so starting from zero to seven positions of a eight bit or a byte or if it is unsigned long you will have this so go through this you can test a flag with adding you can bit range you can uh, get the bit range by this particular bit underscore position m plus one mm, uh, one minus n minus one left shift it by n times will give you the range where m is the maximum and bit shift l bit shift r that is left shift and right shift okay mm, bit m flag n f v so maximum flag so clear m flag and get m flag these are all the macros which we will use in the following program to mm, switch between lower case and upper case now unsigned ascii carry a so print f uh, starting character ascii character and fifth bit equals to zero upper case fifth bit equals to one lower case now print f using that macro bit position 5 then it will shift, shift to that particular lower case so we we'll look at by printing that shift just like this so here the bit position takes an integer n and returns a bit mask corresponding to that single bit position bit po position of 0 returns a bit mask for once digit bit position of one returns a bit mask for the two's digit and so on so instead of writing um, hash define a underscore flag bit position 12 and hash define b underscore flag bit position 13 which is less prone to errors the set flag 
macro sets the bit at position f of variable n it opposite its opposite is clear flag which clears the bit at position of f of variable n finally test flag can be used to test the value of the bit at the position if f of variable n is a test flag a so this is how it would be the macro bit range n comma m produces a bit mask <coughs> corresponding to the position through n through positions n through m including with the micro instead of writing this so first octal digit 7 that is triple 1 and octal digit 56 that is triple 1 triple 0 you can write more like this bit range 0 comma 2 and 5 3 comma 5 and much to follow which more clearly indicates which bits are meant the bit shift b comma n can be used to shift left value b into proper bit bit range starting with bit bit n for instance if you had a flag called c that could take on one of the five possible colors the colors might be defined like this so have a look at this hope you get it a truly paranoid programmer might do this if c underscore largest greater than c underscore flag cause an error the flag is not big enough to hold all its possible values hash and if c so the macro clear underscore m flag n comma f is indical uh, to clear flag n comma f except the name is changed so that all the operations on the multi bit flags have a similar naming uh, convention the macro get gets the value of f and so on it can be tested if get underscore m flag is uh, you pass those equals to c underscore blue do something note beware that the macro bit range and set range um, set m flag refer to n arguments twice so the expression set underscore m flag can be written like this will have undefined potential disastrous behavior here is the example of the same